Hey everybody, this is Dean from Photo Blue. Nikon has released a maintenance update for NX Studio. Uh, it was version 1 and we are now at version 1.0.1. .1. And this uh, update adds support for the new Nikon ZFC. It's added support for the Russian language and it's also uh, fixed numerous bugs and kind of tweaked little things in the interface so there's nothing really major but uh it should make uh the program run a little smoother and if you've got a new nikon the zfc it will add support for that so those are important reasons to update so just to show you real quick where to find the updates in nx studio and how to download them uh, you just need to go up to help here and go check for updates Nikon's uh, update uh, feature is a little bit odd. It uses something called Message Center, which will check for updates for any Nikon software that you may use. And uh, so you see there are two updates here. It has one for Picture Control Utility, which actually adds support uh, for NX Studio. And it has NX Studio right here. And if you click on, double click on this, it brings up this web page right here, which uh, gives you the choice of selecting Windows or Macintosh. Just a few things about this page because it can be a little bit confusing. If it opens up with all of these expanded out, it's a pretty long page. And the update is actually way at the bottom of this. So if you, if you click these open to see uh, like what the changes are, it lists all these changes way down at the bottom here is where you um, download and you need to it will ask you to select your region and so you select whatever region you're in and you click accept for the agreement and then you can download the uh, update program once you download the uh, update program all you need to do is double click on the file And uh, then it, it brings up this program here, and all you have to do is click the Update button here. Accept the uh, agreement. Then there's the Read Me text right here. You can just click Next through that, and it will install NX Studio. So the Update program is a little bit unusual in that it brings up a message center first, then you go to a web page, and then it installs... Uh, the program after you download it. A lot of programs now will have the update and will just actually run the update for you and run the entire program. So there's a few extra steps to go through. So if you want to check that it's installed properly or if you ever want to check the version of NX Studio you have, you just go up to help into about and it will give you the version right here and it says it's 1.0.1. Usually if you have a point zero point one in a version that indicates it's just a maintenance update so they fixed some bugs and they may have added some minor things if you have something that's like a point one or point two so if it was version one point one or one point two that would indicate that there were some feature updates and usually when the version goes from one to say two those would be major updates. I'm Dean, and this has been Photo Blue, and I'll see you next time. Don't forget to subscribe, share, and like.